About 1,000 people took part in the 7th Annual Tunnel to Towers Tower Climb in Lower Manhattan. The event celebrates the life and sacrifice of all 9-11 heroes. CBS 2's Christina Fan reports. They started climbing before the sun even rose, scaling 104 grueling floors, the equivalent of 2,226 steps, to finish on the top floor of One World Observatory. The journey symbolizing the strength and resiliency of a city and its people post 9 11. If you ever in those stairwell, it's not easy. And to think that they were running up, many of them were fire gear, uh, you know, over 21 years ago, it's incredible. Every year, 1,000 participants sign up for the Tunnel to Towers Tower Climb to support America's heroes. Among them, Rob Jones, a double amputee Marine Corps veteran. And I just did it. So. If I can do it, there's pretty much anybody out there that can do it. Winning first place this year, So Wai Ching, an athlete from Malaysia who trains by climbing 300 to 400 floors daily. But to him, this wasn't just another sporting title. The reason why I'm doing this every year is to actually honor the sacrifice from the um, police officer, the officer who actually got into the stairs and tried to save people out. So that's the mindset I am imply into this competition. When I come into the stairs, I'm going to give my best. Sunday's event raised over half a million dollars to help fallen first responders and their families with mortgage payments. It also provides a moment to reflect on the many acts of heroism that day, including FDNY Captain Billy Burke's decision to stay behind in the North Tower with stranded civilians. Know that they could die, but he knew he was going to if he stayed behind, and he gave his life to comfort somebody else. I think it's one of the greatest stories of 9-11. The annual climb, making sure these stories are never forgotten. From Lower Manhattan, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News.